Hello everybody, welcome back to the Kent Survival Channel, Andy here. Just a quick one for you today, um, as the title of the video suggests, it's about e-liquid bottles. Uh, it just occurred to me quite recently to order some and try out. Um, they are proven quite handy. So you've probably used these things before, they usually come in sets. Sometimes with a pump as well and a little thing and they're like travel sets for liquids. Well, I find that the pound shop kind of versions of these will kind of leak, the, the, the lid split, the thread goes straight through and the whole top of the lid comes off, that sort of thing. Um, and the more expensive ones are just way too expensive for what they are. They could be, you know, nearly a tenner for a couple of bottles. So I've been trying out these. Um, if it's something you're not going to use too much of, like oil for example, then these are ideal. So, there you go. So the ones I've got here, I've got some oil, I've got some soap, some milk, it's good if you don't use too much milk in your tea or coffee, and some methylated spirits for the stove. So yeah, they're pretty handy little things. These bottles in particular are 15 millilitres I think. I'm um, just looking at the slip that come with them. It's an uh, eBay user car bike man, uh, 5, 10, 15, 20, 30, 50, 100 milliliters. So there's a lot of variety there for different things, but these ones are fine for, uh, say, soap and oil, I think, even milk for me because I barely use any. Um, they're built for liquid, they're PET, so the MEFS is okay. Um, yeah, I think they get on okay with these. I may get some of the slightly bigger ones for, um, for MEFS. For example, because you need a bit of that when I go out, but for, for a day, a two day hike camp, these things are, are pretty ideal. I don't know if anyone else has done a video on this or if anyone else out there uses these. I just thought it was a good idea and uh, thought I'd pass that along to you guys. If you have any better solutions that you think, write down in the comments. I, I'd be happy to hear about that. Um, I'm sure everyone else will as well. Um, but these seem to be working out at the moment for me. I took them to Dartmoor, uh, worked out quite well there. I'm going to use them in a couple of days time in Peak District too. Um, yeah, so that's about all I've got to say on this. As I said, just a quick video, sorry about that. Left something better for you soon. Some more Russian reviews and other things. Um, if you found this interesting, check out my other videos. Um, there's uh, much more detailed videos out there, Russian reviews, overnight camps, uh, kit reviews and other ideas and such so have a look at them there's probably some on the screen right now for you to click on um, thanks very much for watching the video and subscribing and ringing that little bell so you uh, get notifications um, when you do subscribe and i hope to see you in a video soon thanks very much goodbye